My passion in working in this area of sexual and domestic violence comes from really how I was raised as a child and seeing all the injustices that communities and people see. And this was a, this particular area I was really focused in on. And I just, I love it because we can see changes. They may be small steps and it's within not just our organization, it's on a national level and an international level, and I've just always been drawn to this kind of work. It really is an honor to be able to accept this award. It's not on my own, it's with the amazing staff, it's with board, it's with community members, it's about making connections and keeping those connections and keeping fresh and keeping open to all the things that are out there for people who find themselves either in a domestic violence or a sexual assault situation. I used to work at the shelter back in the 80s, yes, the 1980s, as an intern from ASU. The shelters of back in the day are not the shelters of today. The services that used to be provided are very different than they are now. And that, that happens because we all work together in collaboration but it grabbed me. That's how I started with Chrysalis. Chrysalis found me, I found Chrysalis, and it was, it's been an amazing growing opportunity for me because I would never have imagined myself being where I am today 20 or 30 years ago. But Chrysalis formed me. It formed me with relationships, with community partners, with vision, and with drive. And I can't imagine being anywhere else.